What's going on Spartans? Welcome back and today we're going to be doing something really awesome. As you guys know I've been working on my heroes and look at this in 35 minutes my level 30 Barb King is here. Um, it is late at night so I'm going to go ahead and actually do it now. So that means with the 14 gems I accumulated from trees and stuff I'm actually going to have enough to <laughs> basically gem it done. 11 gems. Huge spending spree guys. Um, I honestly... You know, whatever. Forget it. There it is. Level 30 king. Big time, boys. Now I got both heroes at level 30. My queen's at level 32, and I'm working on her at level 33 right now. So I'm getting pumped up, ready to get to level 35 with each of them, and really working hard. Let's go ahead and uh, see how we've been doing in Masters 2. Now I'm going to show you how long it takes to search for a battle up here. Uh, one that you can win a lot of. Obviously, there's a lot of loot here, but you need a serious force to take it all out. And as you know, I'm Garching, so I am trying to farm Dark Elixir, and I'm actually farming all sorts of stuff. Whatever I can find, I do take, uh, just because I don't care about holding in Masters. My defense is a Trap D, as you guys know, and it's actually holding me up here. So I lose probably about 100 trophies a day, maybe even 150, if not more. And my defense manages to pull me back up about 100 to 200 trophies a day. So that's pretty sick. Um, I do lose a lot. I have won several battles. I did just complete my uh, 5,000th win ever, which is super exciting. That'll be the next episode. Stay tuned to see how that happened and uh, see how epic that is. I do get to collect that reward as an achievement. That's pretty cool. It's definitely one of those things that takes at least a year or two to do, and uh, it's, it's a huge achievement. I'm very happy to have completed. Let's continue searching, though. As you can see, it's taken a bit of time. Uh, in a little bit here, if it continues to take a hard time of searching, I will cut it and then clip to a win or clip to a raid I'm going to win or attack and take a bunch of loot from one or the other. Haven't decided doing this live, so we will see what happens. And here we go. We got 2,000 dark show in this one. Not enough dark, not enough loot. I like to find a collector base. That'd be nice. You can find a lot of collector bases in Masters 3, Masters 2. I highly recommend being up here for those because it is super fun. And super easy you do take a little bit of time to search uh, but once you search for a while you do usually find quite a bit of loot it doesn't take too long as you can see I mean it's taken a bit of time here and it's gonna take a little bit longer uh, I don't know how long exactly I might have to clip it uh, hopefully we find this like 10 clicks let's see if we can do it let's see one all right so the reason I'm not attacking these bases number one is they're pretty easy but there's no loot 178,000 gold but no elixir and no dark not worth it so we're gonna click next and then this one, let's see here, nothing at all. So next, even the town halls on the inside, you can see it's always dead center. It's not worth it. I do take town hall snipes because the Masters 2 loot bonus is absolutely awesome to have. Uh, 3200 dark there is pretty solid, but just not enough. 4400, wow. Unfortunately, there's no way with Garch we're going to take that all. Yeah, we don't have all our spells. If we had all our spells, I'd say worth a shot. We could probably do it uh, with our king, but we do not have all our spells. So we're going to click next. And that's unfortunate. So about 443 in this one. Not enough dark. It's kind of a struggle sometimes to find a raid. As you can see. Um, just the reason I'm not attacking most of these bases is that they just don't have enough showing. Even if they're hard to get to, I usually will attack. It just has to do about the amount that it's showing. Unless it's like impossible to get half of it, then it's just not worth it. But I must win about 200,000 of each plus at least 1,500 to 3,300 dark to make me happy. Anything over 3,500 dark makes me really, really happy. Uh, 1500 dark though is the minimum offer win. You'll see that. Like I honestly will sometimes just drop my spells right in the dark elixir storage just to get a guaranteed 2000 dark and then see what my troops can do. Uh, that's a really good strategy that they might nuke in the future. So use it while you can. <laughs> and uh, let's see here. You know what? We're going to cut this in a second. And yep, 2500. One more click. If I don't get it, we're going to cut it. So here we go. Hopefully everyone's having a good weekend or a good week, I should say. And here we go. We're back, and here we are with a 300k of each raid and 4,000 dark elixir. Let's find out how much we can steal, but as you can see, it's all in those collectors, which is awesome news. Um, it is going to make it a little hard because it has some of them inside the walls, which is unfortunate, but not the biggest deal. We will place our double lightning on this mortar, I believe, right here, and we shall take that out pretty easily. And to do a little bit of damage to the level 30 queen, not really anything special, though. Uh, you know, I wish I could put more damage on her, but not really a big deal. We do already have 3% of the base, so I'm going to spread out my archers, go for the percentage. So they're going to take out a few of these outside buildings and uh, just try and get as much percentage as possible right off the bat. As you can see, 
just layering him down just a little bit just so I can make sure to get as much as possible and see what is out of range here we go wall breaking in now we do want to wall break into the segments that do have two mines in them and that is definitely the right way to do that so here we go dropping a few archers and a bunch of goblins man I am super tired right now guys it is super late it's like 2 30 in the morning uh, central US time which is crazy and uh, let's see here where we're we gonna drop the rest of our troops 46 archers left hmm we're at 22% I don't know if we can win this one uh, but we are gonna go for as much as loot as possible so let's start dropping down some oh wait we don't we're those out of range Wow we got lucky there all right so we're gonna take out this building here to get the percentage and should we wall break in no yeah we're gonna wall break in here we go into that and now we have one oh man there's a gold storage up there all on its own we'll have to wall break in there too that's unfortunate so a couple goblins down to distract and then a wall break in of course dropping a bunch more goblins now to make sure we eat away at that elixir storage and a few archers and a few more goblins now, i overdid it with the goblins on accident guys that's unfortunate quite a waste uh way overdid it on the archers and goblins there that's a shame i should not have done that but hopefully my king could take the hits from a wizard down here and really help me out we shall see though it's gonna be interesting dropping the king now and oh boy oh boy and he's going for the wall that's good we can start dropping our troops now a wall break in hopefully yep we got the double segment open so that's great now we drop some goblins down and our king and it's gonna be a nice easy steal right there we do have 43 more goblins left unfortunately we don't have any wall breakers to get to that last wall so that is a problem so we're gonna drop down these goblins here and go for this elixir and oh man if I leave 82,000 gold on the oh, that's gonna be bad if I leave 82,000 gold on the freaking board uh, but anyway, we're going to go ahead and just finish this up here. We don't have much left as far as truce. About 45% of the base has been stolen. I don't have high hopes here for this, but we're going to drop our troops in the corner and then try and distract with an archer or two on that right side here and a couple goblins. Uh, not working too well, unfortunately. Uh, but I am using the goblins as a small distraction, hoping that the wizard will not get to them. Oh my god, it's going to be close, guys. Oh no! 48%. Oh, it does not look like... Oh man. We failed, guys. It's okay, though. We did win 250,000 and 284,000 plus 2,600 dark, which is pretty solid. Once again, though, a fail and not a big deal because we're not pushing trophies. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Stay tuned for the next episode. I'll have some epic raids in it, and we'll also have that 5,000 to win. Super fun. See you then. Peace.